This small ampule has made people feel better, faster and quietly made some people worse. Let's talk medicine, not assumptions. Most patients don't ask for a drug, they ask for a feeling. If I take an injection, I'll improve faster. And that belief is exactly why this video matters. This is Diclofenac, an NSAID, strong, fast, effective. Its injectable form blocks prostaglandins, reducing pain, inflammation, and yes, fever. That speed is why it works. That speed is also why it needs respect. Power works both ways. In everyday OPD practice, Diclofenac is most commonly used by the intramuscular route. When an injection is chosen, it is given deep intramuscularly using the correct technique. The preferred site is the upper outer gluteal region. The deltoid is generally avoided because it has less muscle bulk and a higher risk of local irritation. Before giving any injection, ask one question. Have you ever had a drug allergy? Because Diclofenac allergy exists and anaphylaxis does not wait. That one question separates routine practice from responsible practice. Now about fever. Yes, Diclofenac can bring fever down. Yes, patients feel dramatic relief. But fever is not one disease. Diclofenac affects platelets and can stress the kidneys. That is why it should not be used in suspected or confirmed dengue fever. In dengue, platelets are already low. Adding this drug can increase the risk of complications. In dengue, the safer choice is clear. Paracetamol. So, when do we say no? If the kidneys are weak, no. If the heart is failing, no. Dehydration, peptic ulcer disease or third trimester pregnancy, absolutely not. Because the consequences are not mild. Acute kidney injury, gastrointestinal bleeding, injection site abscess or anaphylaxis. Now let me be very clear, Teclofenac is not a bad drug. In my own practice, I use Teclofenac for the right patient at the right time for the right indication. It gives strong pain relief and good control of inflammation when used thoughtfully. The problem is never the drug. The problem is using it without thinking. Here is the real message. Injections don't work better just because they are injections. They work better only when the drug, the patient and the situation match. Medicine is not about making patients feel better fast. It is about making sure they stay better longer.